A crime novelist turned murderer. Some have given him the nickname, The Lying Dutchman. Dutch crime author Richard Klinkhammer's wife mysteriously disappeared in 1991. He was the prime suspect, but without enough evidence, authorities had to let him go. One year after her disappearance, he visited his publisher with a new manuscript, which was titled Wednesday. Mince Day. Carpet Day! The novel was a gruesome list of ways he could have killed his wife, with one of the methods being him pushing her through a meat grinder and feeding the bits to pigeons. As you can imagine, the book was so morbid that his publishers rejected it. Another five years go by and his wife is nowhere to be found, so he hires a lawyer so he can pronounce her dead and sell the house. He sells the house, moves to Amsterdam, and begins collecting a widower's pension. Back at his former home, the new owners begin construction on the property, and a grisly discovery is made. Under the garden shed, a human skull is found, the skull of Hanalore Klinkhammer. Richard was arrested that evening and confessed to beating her with a wrench, burying her under the shed, and using compost to cover up the smell of decaying flesh. Richard Klinkhammer was sentenced to seven years in prison, but was released after only two for good behavior in 2003. In January of 2016, he took his own life at the age of 78.